Hey guys, okay, so I want to take this mo uh, moment here to go over how to grip a kettlebell properly. Um, there's not a lot of, of advanced stuff in my program in terms of kettlebell, but, you know, with snatches and things like that. However, I want to make sure that you have the ability to grip the kettlebell for future when I start putting those things into your program. So, gripping a kettlebell, if I'm standing, so pretend I'm standing as opposed to kneeling here, and I'm going to use my right arm for something, the kettlebell is on the ground and it is on a 45 degree angle facing to the left, okay? You are going to grab that furthest corner from you with an okay grip. So you're going to create the okay sign with your hand and you're going to grip the kettlebell. So I'm going to go underneath, I'm going to grip it, I'm just going to rotate the kettlebell over so you can see that I have that okay sign grip. These three fingers always just go along for the ride. I will wrap them around the bell, but they're nice and loose, okay? So from here, no matter what you're doing, whether it's a kettlebell snatch, a kettlebell clean, a kettlebell swing, uh, you're holding it for windmills, Turkish get-ups, whatever the exercise is, that's how you uh, hold the kettlebell. The only time I wouldn't hold a kettlebell like that is if you were using the kettlebell to do push-ups on top of. I'd rather you hold it right in the middle. That way, you know, your weight displacement is going straight through the kettlebell and you're not going to topple over, obviously risking injury. So from here, get that OK sign. I'm just going to clean it up to my uh, to the rack position. <sharp inhale> okay, and let it notice that these three fingers just went along for the ride, and that is how you hold a kettlebell.